I'm joined now by the governor of Missouri, Jay Nixon. Governor, thank you very much for being with us. Tell me, why has a full week elapsed and we still do not know anything? The public wants answers to what happened between Michael Brown and the white officer who shot and killed him. Well, it's been a challenging week with the horrific death of Michael Brown, shot down in the streets of his hometown, uh, and the, the appropriate energy and angst that everyone's had around there. I think with the dual investigations going on right now, with the Justice Department and with the local prosecutor, and I'm especially uh, appreciative, I, after talking to General Holder, I've appreciated uh, them sending in 40 additional FBI agents uh, to make sure that they're moving to get a thorough investigation to get justice here, um, and, and uh, I appreciate that uh, their response and that, that energy to make sure that they get this right. But why is it taking so long? And you also have a county prosecutor who many say has a conflict of interest here because he said that he disagreed strongly uh, with your decision to bring in the county police. He called it shameful, saying that he thought that was, in fact, an illegal decision. So how is he the person that would be trusted by this very angry and resentful community to come up with answers that are credible? Well, he's a seasoned prosecutor that has an opportunity to step up here and 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 do his job. And uh, also, though, with when you see a dual investigation going on and the resources of the Justice Department and FBI uh, agents out working in the community yet again yesterday, 40 additional officers, uh, I think that having those dual investigations will help guarantee that this gets done in a timely fashion, that it's done thoroughly, uh, and that it gets justice.